while the M-complex is for menopausal problems, and it works really quite well. Now, there could be other factors that need to be addressed, such as the kidneys, if uh, they're not working very well, you know, they control the amount of fluid in your body. So if they're not working very well, then your body's trying to get rid of fluid from the skin or through the skin, and then you get these hot flashes with the excessive sweating. So there are some cases of hot flashes going away by fixing the kidneys up. And of course, if you're eating some um, high carbohydrate food or sugar or something, that only makes everything worse. And there is an effect with the liver. The liver processes all hormones to make them usable by the body. So there's two forms of hormones. One is floating around in the, in the blood, not utilizable. And then it, the liver conjugates them to make them utilizable. So there could be liver dysfunction causing hot flashes. It could be adrenal dysfunction. So while the M-complex is something that you can just start taking and uh, get some relief, while you're fixing up the organs. And then Wild Yam can actually do its own uh, repair of the hormonal system or liver or whatever might need to be addressed. So it's a bit more complex than just taking a pill. If you have a good practitioner, then you can have some, some success. And then suddenly, you know, six months later, the hot flashes come back. And that means there's another organ that needs help. And then um, six months after that, they may come back. And then a different organ needs help. And then I've seen this happen before, and then at some point you have it under control. So there could be some like breakthrough hot flashes, and but just uh, be persistent. And I know they're really annoying, but we can get over this with natural healthcare.